All right, so this is the video I was telling you about yesterday, or whenever I decide to upload that other one. I'm lazy, never do the right stuff when I need to. But me and my buddy Jason, he owns the toy shop in Corbin. Uh, this is our little collaborative video. So what we're gonna do is if you go to his shop after seeing this, the toy shop's on Corbin and Main Street? South Main Street. Say, hey, saw that video. We're gonna give away some stuff. First person that goes down there and says, hey, you know, I saw that crazy dude's video. I don't know why you even talked to him. We'll get a deck box. We'll get these little, these little cool uh, thank you promos from Champions Pass, which I've never seen. I think these are awesome. Um, and two amazing rares. We got an amazing rare Kyogre, or Kyogre, or however you say that, and an amazing rare Yvettel. Now, I think these are awesome because these quality of these cards are way better than Magic cards. Like, if Magic cards would do this, it would be ridiculous. It's a shame that Pokemon can print a product half, half, not as good as magic and it just be beautiful. Anyway, so what we're gonna do here, you come, say, hey, I watched that dude's video. Watch that whack pack crack video. Y'all get that. Put that a thing. Every person after that, after the first person is gonna get a random VMAX card and another one of these or you know whatever Jason decides to give you. Just be like, hey man, load me down. He's a good fella, I'm sure he would. <clears throat> All right, so we're gonna move these out of the way because we're gonna bust this pack or this box of uh, battle styles here. Now all these cards are brought to you by the toy shop. They're letting us, we're kind enough to let us open these and uh, see what we're getting here. So yeah, let's uh, let's get in it. Which I don't know why he's letting me do this. I never open anything good. Uh -uh. Like here, open my packs and make sure I don't open anything of value. Uh, well, okay, well, I pick good boxes when I'm not the one opening them. Well, that ain't no good. Hopefully that didn't damage the cards in there. How you gonna do that, Nintendo? Sit over here bragging on you, and then you're gonna package your product crappy. All right, so I got a fancy way of sorting this. I don't really know if... It matters here, but we'll, we'll give her a test run. Code card. Uh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, well, I went too far in the crap. Actually, no, we got two rares, so I didn't go too far in the crap. But that's that's not terrible. A little reverse there. A little regular rare. They really don't want me to open these packs the right way these days, do they? Code card. One, two, three, four. So what we're looking for is the fancy Urshifus and the Tyranitar. Those are the money cards. We ain't gonna open them because I'm terrible and I don't open anything good, but look at that. Look at this garbage and we'll open up a two, the same rare, back to back. How y'all gonna do that to me? I remember I opened up, I think it was one of my first, uh, first um, little fancy Crobat boxes. I opened up like six of those packs, there's code card. And uh, I pulled that Celebi rare like four times in a row. Or three times in a row or something. It was stupid. Bulk. And if for some reason you don't like me flying through this, tell me. And I probably will still do it, but I'll try to not go as fast. Some people are like, oh, I like the artwork. No, you don't. Code card. You like these code cards is what you like. Let's get real. Boop. Oh, I see Fancy back there. Gonna hit some money. We got Corviknight VMAX. Little fancy card there. See, like, even the quality of these cards are just excellent compared to Magic cards. 
Like, you can take one of these. This don't, cor this don't curl. This don't bend. You can put this in a sleeve. Nothing happens to this card. This is excellent quality. Wizards, take a hint, buddy. Code card. Oh, well, I just destroyed that. A little uh, casualty of war there. Oh, do we see, do we got fancy back here? Old camping gear. Now we're gonna take out that pile yet. But yeah, hopefully we'll uh, we'll have a few more of these uh, collaboration videos, and y'all get to open up more, or get to see me open up more boxes. Code card. If this one goes good, this could all just be like bulk rares, and Jason's like, "Dude, you suck. Get out of here." Oh, I think we got a good card back there. That is the one thing that I don't like about opening Pokemon is like you know immediately whether you're going to open a good card or not. So it takes the surprise out of it. But that's all right. That's all right. Tyranitar V, but not the good one because I opened it. I mean, it's still still pretty cool. It's just we want the one where he's like, I don't know, asleep, eating something in the woods. Not bad, not bad. So you could you could win this card. You could stop by and be like, Jason, give me that Tyranitar. He'll probably be like, okay. So if you want a Tyranitar, come in and be like, hey, I saw that video. He'll be like, what video? What are you talking about? Go card. Oh, that dude broke in here and just started opening my stuff. Like, I don't know. What do you know? We didn't give you nothing. Bulk, bulk, bulk. Well, you win some, you lose some. Little foil uh, reverse here. and uh... See, like, even their, even their regular stuff, like, that's not their reverse, is just infinitely better than magic cards. Uh, their packaging could, could use a little work, but you know, beggars can't be choosers. Cup card. So you like, we we know we're not getting anything here, so it's big sad times. But that's okay because we've got packs left. Man, that was a just garbage pack. We didn't we didn't hit nothing out of that. Like we hit a really bad foil uncommon, and that guy that was that was rough. I'd hate to be the 10-year-old kid that goes into Walmart and buys that pack. Well, that's saying if the 10-year-old kid can actually find packs at Walmart. Code card. I was at Walmart like 10 minutes ago. That was longer than that, but wasn't nothing there. Wow, that pack was equally as tra crappy. Rough times. Oh well, we're, we're still getting there. It's been a long time since I opened that actual box of Pokemon cards. We were code card. I think it was Guardians Rising and Tapu Lele when that was the hotness. We were trading the bulk out of the out of the boxes in for another box because the Pokemon bulk was just so good then. Man, we keep whiffing. At least we got two rares out of that pack, but we're due for another good hit. Here's another little secret. You can tell by the, usually you can tell by the code card. If it's just straight white, you're either gonna hit a good card or a regular hollow rare. If it's green, you ain't gonna hit nothing. So that's green. So unfortunately, one, two, three, four, we're probably not gonna hit anything. I don't know why they do that. I don't know if the, the white ones weigh less than the green ones, so it stops people from weighing the packs. I have no idea. Um, I mean, I'm sure you could figure out a way to make them the same color and make them weigh differently, but I don't know. They know more about it than I do. I just open packs, I don't know. And don't pull anything. Code card. Uh, 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 no. I cheated right there for a minute. Shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done that. He's just a boy. That actually looks like a shiny thing. 
Well, we've uh, not done too hot on this half. Hopefully the next half is infinitely better. Oh, green again, big sad. This is actually good. This is a good playable common. This is in one of the best decks in the format right now. Oh, nope, wrong stack. Pokemon's doing real good right now, real hot. Uh, the next set is uh, Chilling Rains, I think. I think it's what it's called, Code Card. Oh, I might get something good out of this one. And everywhere I've seen it's already sold out. And we don't even know like what most of the cards are in it. Yeah, we got some fancy back here. So hopefully we'll get to open some of that fancy stuff. Huh, Bruno. Reminds me of that movie with uh, Sasha Baron Cohen. Hi, I'm Bruno. <clears throat> Corbinite V. Mark, these, I just cannot get over how good quality these cards are. Wizards, see, they used to make good quality cards. Like back in the day, the, the Watsy stuff that they made for Pokemon. Ooh, we might get another good one was actually really good quality. Like, unless you played with it on the schoolyard, like most people did, like your stuff probably held up. Like I've got stuff from back in the day that's, I mean, looks excellent. Like a few of my Charizards look great. And Corviknight VMAX, except this one is the, the Rainbow Rare version. So, I mean, sure, we pulled the same card twice, but that's okay because that's fancy. We pulled three Corviknights. It's all right. It's all right. So I don't know if the layout is the same as it used to be back in the day, but you were pretty much, you had 12, code card, uh, 12 hollow hits, like 12 good hollow hits. And I don't, I don't know if they do the same with this or not, but I guess we'll find out. Which back then you could easily weigh the cards. I never did it because I was like six. But if I knew about it, oh yeah. Single strike energy. There is a deck around this, the single strike guy. It's not as good as the other one, but. You know, oh. I'm actually building the uh, the rapid strike version. I'm a few Urshifus off, but that's okay. We'll pick them up. Oh, uh, good cards? No. See, good commons. Actually, that's an uncommon. Look at it. Yeah, it's an uncommon. That's weird. Watch out. I guess I'm going to stop flipping them over. I guess that ruins it. Ruins the fun. Cup card. Phoebe. Not bad. So that's that messed up pack. Maybe we'll pull like a crimp or something. Pull a crimp Tyranitar. That would be nice. Let's see if there are any crimp down here. I think we actually did pull something cool. Code card. Let's cheat. Oh, maybe we didn't. Hmm, maybe it's a fluke. Who knows? Looks like we did. Nope, I'm just blind. Oh well, that's all right. All right, so that half the box, we, I mean, we done okay. We done okay. I mean, Rainbow Rare, VMAX, but we'll see. I, I got a feeling this next half of the box is gonna be where it's at. Well, I mean, as good as it can be if I'm opening it, so you know. We're only going to lose like $100 here instead of cup card. Oh, I cheated again. That means we're going to get something good, though. Bulk. Crap, 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 crap. Slow roll this one. What we got? Oh, it's blue. 
Empoleon Rapid Strike. Um, I've actually not seen this one before. That's really weird. That's a really weird card. It still looks cool though. First V in the second half of the box. Code card. Bulk. Bulk, 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 bulk. Hey, hey, like people talk crap about this card, but this, this card's excellent. Play with it on the, the TCG online. You play in that rapid strike deck and it literally says demonic tutor for anything you want once turn. Busted. For those of you that don't know what a demonic tutor is, it means you can go get a card anything you want. Well, in this case, anything that's got rapid strike on it once turn, which is pretty good. Oh, we got fancy back here. Can't tell. Bulk, 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 nothing. That's all right. I know y'all just want to see the good cards. That's what you're here for. You're here for them code cards. Bulk, 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 bulk. Nothing. It's all right. It's all right. Some of the box openings that I don't like to watch, I'm not gonna like name any names, mainly because I don't know who they are. They'll do something like this. I'll, I'll do this pack like that. Energy. Durant. More peaks. See, I'm already getting bored. Like, it's, like they do that on every card. Like they're like, oh look, look, look. Like nobody cares. Go through all the bulk. Hit the good cards, if there's good cards. If there's not, go to the next pack. See, we as humans have a very small attention span. Nobody wants to see the bulk. They want to see the, they want to see the money. Which, you know, I don't know why you're watching me, because I never pull anything, but. Bloop, 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 bloop. Look, boom, nothing. Then we go to the next pack. And see, with Pokemon, it's easier to do it with magic, easier than, than magic cards, because you usually know if you're going to hit something good. So, like, you know when to slow down. See, like, I'm not going to do it on camera because I don't want you to see, but, like, I know I'm not going to hit anything out of this pack. So, I'm just like, whoop. Look, nothing. Then we go to the next one. Oh, man. Cody just gave us a surprise. I should, that sounded awful. Never mind. One, two, three, four. Crap, 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 crap. See, like, I mean, this looks cool. Like, little me would be like, oh, this is awesome. We, we, we got about eight packs left or something in this box. Like, we're, we're bound to hit another good one. Is it going to be here? Probably not. I do like, I, I feel like out of my packs that I've been opening, I've not been getting double rares a lot. And a lot of these packs have been double rare packs. But if you're looking for a hobby to get into, if you're not into the Pokemon, right now Pokemon is on fire. Like, even these big companies are giving you, like, five cents a card for your bulk, which is insane. I mean, I've seen it higher, but, I mean, it's pretty good. Five cents a card for bulk. If Magic was like that, I'd be a millionaire. All right, we're going we're gonna to hit a good one. We're going to hit a good one. What we got? What we got? Single Strike Urshifu. Now, if that was a Rapid Strike, it would be a lot better. But this is still not bad. Like I said, there's a deck around the other one, around this one. Um, it's just not as good as the other one. But this is still a good hit. Um, I would tell you value, but I honestly don't know it. I think I got time to keep up with that stuff. Come on now. Code card. Bulk, 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 bulk. I 
actually some decks are running this, the single strike decks. I mean, I'm not. I'm not going to waste a card in my deck. But, you know, it's not bad. Come card. Oh, I don't know. It looks like we got something back here, but... Nope. Man, we have pulled the absolute crap out of these Aegis Lashes. Too bad those aren't like... 10 bucks or something. It's sitting pretty. Code card. Blah. Nothing. How rude. We're due for a hit. We're due for a hit. It's been it's been a few packs. We got a hit back there. We'll see. So now we can slow roll this one. Let's see what we got here. Oh, oh, actually, I think it might be getting something good. Rap, that's the money. That is the money right there. That's the card we want. Well, it's not the card we want, but it is a card we want. That is, it's up there. I want to say this is like, Close to thirty bucks, um, but yeah, this is this is this is the card. That's I actually need some of those. That's the card. We want to find that guy in his alternate art form, in his little secret rare form code card, because that's where the money's at, or the Tyranitar, of course, the Tyranitar. Buck, 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 buck. Double rare, double foil rare, actually. Code card. Blah, bulk. All right, last pack. We're going to slow roll this one no matter what. Code card. Need that Tyranitar. Make this fancy. Well, I don't know if I got anything back here. Maybe we won't slow roll it. Yeah, crap. Okay, we didn't get anything, but that's all right. Um, this Urshifu is pretty good, though. Like, that's a pretty solid hit. Uh, the Rainbow Rare Corviknight, I don't know where we're at on that. But, I mean, it's a pretty good hit. All in all, you know, not bad. Not bad. Especially for me. Usually, I'm surprised I even pulled a foil. All right. So, a little surprise or whatever. Cody walked over here and handed me a stack of Vivid Voltage, so maybe we'll pull a Tubby Pikachu. So we got ten packs of Vivid Voltage. So let's go ahead and hit that up while we're while we're here. We'll leave those out fancy, so y'all can take a gander. Code card. We're gonna separate all that. We ain't gonna separate the energies. Uh, bulk. Oh, well, break my camera here. Hold up, let me fix it. I'm fat, man. I can't help it. Oh, well, I got fat hands. What do you want me to do? And fat everything else. Y'all see that video the other day, my double chin? Yeah. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. It's rough. Try my best not to get on camera, but well, code card. Try my best not to get on camera, but shooting a video in your car is a terrible idea. I advise against it. Man, just opening up a bunch of bulk today. We're gonna hit something good out of this. We're gonna hit that tubby Pikachu. Oh, we're gonna hit something good out of this for sure. I don't like how the code cards are backwards, so you know that you're going to hit something, but that's okay. That's okay. Buck, 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 buck. Well, okay, yeah, we got something back there. What we got? What we got? What we got? Ampharos V. Well, that's a pretty card. I saw electric. I was like, oh, we're going to hit that shoe. Nope. 
We still got something more to go. We got a few more to go. Right. See, now I know there ain't nothing in it, so I'm not even gonna go. I'm just gonna. Well, I guess I shouldn't do the four because it confuses me because I'm dumb. Ah, look, and then I stuck them in the wrong stack. That's okay. And they really don't want me to get into these. Good Lord. Code card. Bah. Drone wrote them. Actually, this card right here sees play in that Cramorant deck. I'm not a big fan of that deck, but to each their own, I guess. A buddy of mine got it built, and it was not very good. He insisted it was great, though. He was like, oh, no, 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 it can, it can win. I'm like, all right. And then it proceeded to lose like six times in a row. I'm like, Where's that win at, bud? Oh, I'm just, I'm just drawing like shit. Or, drawing like crap. Um... Anyway, I'm sorry about that. We're trying to we're trying to go away from that, especially for the uh, the uh, collaboration videos. If you want to hear me be mad and cuss about nonsense, go watch my stupid videos. I'm sure it will happen. See, like this card's named Beauty, but like I I don't know. That's really just not my type right there. Could have named her like Milf, Milf. That'd have been a cool card. Would have played that one. And it's not even that good. If you go first, you may play this card. Draw two cards. Like, why not just run like the the ancestral recall version of that code card? I guess if you like, you're playing limited Pokemon. I don't even know if you do that. Like Pokemon draft. That would be a cool idea. I mean, I know they do like Pokemon pre-releases, but they kind of like stack it to where your deck has to be playable. Well, just ruined that one. Oh, and this is a good pack too. Maybe I didn't. Code card. Come on, fat Pikachu. Give me the tubby man. Toka Kiss V. Well, we, we got a fat guy. It's just not the fat guy we want. But that's cool. Now I'm gonna have to fix all these big stack of crap that I've been putting in the wrong slot again. All right, two more packs. Need that tubby Pikachu. All right, we're gonna get something good. Code card. Actually, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna lay this pack right here. Slightly still on camera because we know there's a good thing in that, and I hate the last pack not being something good. Or we can just get two good packs. That's fine. Code court. One, two, three, four. Bulk, 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 bulk. Uh-oh, uh-oh, we got something good back here. What we got, what we got, what we got? Oh! It's a shiny rainbow. What we got? What we got? Aga slash V Max. Oh, it's not rainbow. It's just full art. Whatever. Aga slash V Max. That's pretty cool. Fancy, fancy. I like the texture on this. Like I like the etched. Like even Magic. Like Magic doesn't do their etched stuff like this. Like this is what an etched card should be. But no, we get like dumb promos or Japanese cards that I can't read. Okay, well, I just opened this pack wrong and just screwed the pooch on that one. So, oops. Yeah. But we did get a cool-looking Xerneas. That's pretty cool. All right, well, I opened that backwards, and I didn't get the last pack the way I wanted it to because of me. But that's all good. So, this box, this whole, all this, the extra vivid voltage, the battle styles, the code cards, everything is by the toy shop. So if you're in the Corbin area, drop by. Like I said, first person that mentions this and drops by. High Dragon Welcome Pack from Champions Path, which I think is awesome. It says, well, thank you in the corner. I think it's great. great. See, Magic don't even do this anymore. They don't care. Pokemon's where it's at. They care about their people. 
Yvettel and Kyroger Amazing Rares. Right there is like, you know, 20 bucks or something. Just for free. Just for coming in and saying, hey, man, I watched that video with that ridiculous guy. Like, why are you even, why do you talk to him? Why do you mess with him at all? Just come in and say something like that. And like, Jason will hook you up, man. Box, cards, you know, whatever. You, I guarantee if you're like, hey, man, I really want that random V card that he opened on that video. He'll probably just be like, here, awesome. Thanks for stopping by. Here it is. Anyway, I'm going to keep rambling. I'm going to stop rambling, rather, because I've been rambling for a while. But all this, the toy shop, South Main Street, Corbin, go by, say hello, spend a little bit of money, talk crap about me. Everybody around here loves doing it, so go ahead and do it, too. All right, I'm going to catch you guys later. Thanks for watching.